Hey guys, Scott here. This is going to be another quick video on how to change the template Joomla users or Joomla 1.5 users. Now, I won't be showing you how to find other templates in this video, but by the time you see this video, if you're on my site watching it, there'll be a link here that actually will link you to another tutorial that shows you how to find a good template for your website and how to install that. So now let's just look in this tutorial, we're just going to look at how to change the template Joomla is using. So you want to log into your Joomla website, just yoursite.com forward slash administrator to log into your admin site of Joomla or wherever you install Joomla 2 followed by forward slash administrator. So once you've logged in, you want to go to extensions at the top here and you want to go down to template manager and then just select that. Now we're just going to change the template like through the templates that come with Joomla. From a fresh installation of Joomla, there'll be three templates. And if you mouse over the blue link on the template name, it'll show you a quick sample of the template. So just mouse over to find the one you want to use. Now, you know which one's currently being used because of the default column here. There'll be a star beside the one that's being used at the moment. So I'm just going to bring up my Joomla site at the same time here. So you can see the template I'm using. So that's the standard template with the standard sample data. That's what it looks like. So now I'm just going to change it, the template to another one that comes with Joomla. So all you need to do, say you wanted this JA Purity as your default template, just select the circle beside it so that there's a green dot and click default. Now you'll see that the star in the default column has actually moved beside the JA Purity. So that's actually changed the template that Joomla uses. So if we come back to my site here, now I haven't refreshed the page yet, so this is what the site did look like. Now when I click refresh, you'll notice that the whole site actually changes. Templates are very powerful and they can really change the look of your whole website that easily with pretty much just by saying use this as the default. It changes the whole website. You'll see that that's totally different to the last one. Let's change it again. I'm going to change it to B's this time. And it's click default. So now the default star has moved beside B's. Now if we go back to my Joomla site, you'll see it's still this one because I haven't refreshed. I'll refresh. And again, Joomla, it changes the total look of the website. You wouldn't know it's still the same site. That's how easy it is to change a Joomla template. And they're just the three basic templates that come with Joomla for free. When you install the template later, the template you install will actually appear in here. It will come in under at number four underneath the um, Milky Way template. And all you do there is select the template you installed and click default. Let's set it back to the one I started on. So I'm going to set this Milky Way back to default. Now just refresh this to make sure. Okay, so you can see that's back to how it was when I started. So let's say I wanted to use this template, but I wanted to have a look at some details or edit some stuff about it. All you do here is click on the link for the template. So I'd click this here. This will actually take you into the editing the parameters and stuff for this template. Now you'll see there's actually not much of a choice here. There's only changing some colors and changing some background colors and the width of the template. Every template has different control abilities and stuff. There will different parameters you can change. The better the template usually has more options. Now if you actually get a template from Rocket Themes, which make really good um, Joomla template, which I'll talk about once I've made this um, tutorial. So just click this find a template for Joomla tutorial here and there'll be another video on that where I talk about it more. But their templates have a massive option of parameters to change and you can customize the templates really well. So that's the template parameters. So once you've done that, you can save your new changes on that, but I haven't changed anything, so I'm just going to close. So that's how you change the template and how you edit templates. So 
to edit them, you just select the template you want and click on it. You can also tick the circle beside it and click edit. Same way you do the default, which is just as easy. That's basically all there is to changing templates and editing them. So all you need to do now is find the template you like, install it and activate it.